Dominique, your thoughts on young Justin Fields' answer there? Uh, I mean, it seems like an obvious answer. No one is ready to play right now. We haven't even started training camp. But I could imagine that this is going to be one of those things like when Justin Fields last uh, year in the preseason said that uh, the game felt slow to him. This is one of those things that is probably going to hang over him and people are going to use against him. But the fact of the matter is, no one's ready. We're not even in training camp. Leave that man alone. He's just trying to get ready to get a little bit better. And of course, he needs to learn that sometimes you got to lie to us. We don't want the truth all the time because we're going to find ways to pick at you if, you if you're a little too honest, which he was right there. Yeah, I mean, I didn't have any problem with the comments, right? He's being honest. Like, you're not supposed to be ready to play uh, in the middle of June. Lewis, what did you think? Look, I mean, I, I get what you're saying, that no one's ready to play a football game right now because your mindset's not really geared towards that. But I'm, I'm going to go a little deeper on this. Look, I, I think there's, look, there's a huge learning curve for him. He's learning a whole new offense again. All right? And this, is, this to me, sounds like someone who's saying, hey, look, I'm, I'm, I have a lot of things I'm trying to really right now download into my brain so I can play a little bit faster and play with more confidence this year and make that huge second-year leap. And I'm not ready right now. Come September, of course he's going to say, yeah, I'll be ready then. Well, we'll see. We'll see how ready they are. And I don't think this is just about Justin. Look, I know he's not really talking about this, but this football team around him, you tell me how they got better offensively to the point where – he will then be able to just let his athletic ability shine. I don't see it, man. I don't see it, and I hate that for him. I hate it for him, but I think this is going to be, as you said, uh, Dan, this could be an ugly year for Chicago. I, I just really think it could be. Well, we'll see if Justin Fields has what it takes to overcome the adversity in front of him in year <laughs> two. But Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.